This is a review of the Dyson DC25 Animal, a uh, bagless upright vacuum cleaner. Unique in its design, rather than having wheels, it moves along on a large purple ball, which you can see down there. These two wheels are actually only for support when it's not in use. Push that down, the wheels come up, and easily move along on this ball. Just a little twist of the handle gets it to turn left or right. Push it back up, locks back into place on the two support wheels. The hose attachment actually comes out of the top. Flip that up, pull this all the way out, and there you go. I'd say this extends, oh, about 10 feet. Plenty far enough. But what's great about this vacuum cleaner, not so much the compact design, not so much easy movability, is the strong suction power. I've only tested in a small area of my floor so far. To be specific, this hallway, running just to right about there. So we want to say 12 feet by 3.5 feet. Well, last night I had my little Roomba vacuum cleaner out and about. And to give this what I thought was a thorough cleaning, I saw this little tire marks going around. But in about 45 seconds of using this Dyson, I was amazed at how much the Roomba had left behind. Look at that. Unbelievable. A 12 by 3, 4 foot area. Already vacuumed last night picked up by the Dyson. I'm worried to do my whole house. It's likely this entire canister will be full by the time. They say the uh, animal model is great for people with pets, as you might expect. And my pets, really not that big. Hi Jimmy. But apparently they leave quite a mess. A couple of the attachments it comes with this uh, multi-function tool. You've got the brush. Slide that down. Pop it back up. Snaps back into place. And we've got another attachment. Again, they lock into place so you don't easily lose them. I apologize. It's a little difficult to do one-handed. Let's try this another way. Where is it? Is it this? That looks like it. No? Just takes a little bit of tension. And pops right out. Overall, I'm very impressed with this vacuum cleaner. Oh, I'm sorry. Also, being the uh, animal model rather than the all floors model, it comes with this power brush attachment for doing upholstery and stairs. I have not had a chance to try that out, but judging by the performance so far, I think it'll do just nicely. So this retails for about $550, $600. You can find it online at times, as little as $350, $300 if you're lucky. I happen to be lucky tonight, so I picked it up for $280 actually. So if you can hold out, I recommend it. But if you're looking for a replacement vacuum cleaner and you want a bagless, this is definitely the one to get. Lightweight, compact, and just does a really great job. Alright. Okay, you guys. No more messing up my house. Oscar, that means you.